the, the dry riverbed. Uh, we're gonna walk down here and see if we can find fresh tracks. Uh, maybe we can find a spring book or antelope or something we can shoot for the pond. Looks like a spring book. Uh, so we're gonna go and see what's happening. 100, 150 meters in front of us. And we're still gonna go walk, keep on walking. We'll walk and stalk it. We might be this one, there it goes. We, we pick up a track, a spot a spring book about 150 meters away from us. And um, we're gonna see if we can walk and stalk and see if it's something possible to can use. Put the spring back. It's about 150 meters off. Try to take it. Hopefully we are lucky and we have a good shot today. When you're done, you always see that there's no ammo in your rifle. You clean your rifle and see that it's safe. Let's go see if we can find our oh. Making a nice little spot for a fire. I'm gonna cook a little bit of liver. Beautiful springbok we shot. Just wanna say congratulations on your springbok. Beautiful shot. Got a little brander fang here. Going to brother the liver and the heart. Show you nice piece of liver we cut out. Beautiful piece of muscle, the heart. Gonna cook it too nice in a pot today. Just busy cleaning the liver quickly. We just have the meat, nothing else on it. All just little pieces. You see, it's not liver. Let's try to get it off, guys. I'm gonna cut my liver in little small little blocks. Just make sure when you clean your liver, you not waste meat. Just after a very nice long walk and stalk this morning, we shot the, the spring mark. Uh, nice campfire going on, we can uh, cook the liver for us in a pot and make a nice sandwich for us that we can eat uh, before we go back home. Now so guys, just telling you what we're doing here. Uh, this morning Ian took a beautiful shot, shot a springbok, um, as you guys saw. We walked and stalked it, that's the beauty of hunting, just walk and stalk, give the animal just as much a chance that you have to get away. So yeah. We gutted the springbok, took out the intestines, took out the liver. We saved the meat, because meat is the priority of what we do for hunting. We do not, um, we do not use the meat for anything else but eating. So we just chopped up the liver, got the liver and the heart chopped it up. We're gonna make a nice pot for you guys, like a sandwich. We got our banana vein here, because that is what is hunting, fire, camping out in the bush belt. That's what it's all about. The, bread, the buns is nicely toasted now, so we're gonna take them off. We can doing the, we can put the liver on, pot on the fire, get it nice and hot. A little bit of olive oil that we put in the pot. Onions in the pot. Beautiful onions started to cook. Now, throw in our liver. Make sure they're bright, nice and soft. Gonna make a little nice sandwich. Liver's busy cooking. Nice little boltong spice, homemade spice. Because homemade is the best made. Yeah, let's spice it a little bit. Want some flavor on the on there. Okay, let it cook a little bit. Add a little bit of milk in the liver. Just to start cooking to make the sauce in it. So we sort it. Coming on nicely now. Hello with a nice long sauce. It's gonna be good. Alright, just prepping for the sandwich. And a piece of lettuce on one. Beautiful two pieces of tomato. What do you want better? Where else do you want to be than here in the bush field? Uh, we fried the liver, made a nice pot. Lovely sandwich. Can't wait to taste it. Cheers, bottoms up, guys. Lovely, lovely. Listen, when you're done with everything, Please be a gentleman, pick up all your papers and rubbish 
I put it in the bag. Don't leave it in the in the nature. Close the fire. Please. Respect nature and nature will respect you. <laughs> <laughs>